Hello and welcome. I'm going to show you how to create a really fast and easy VHS effect inside of After Effects today using nothing but its native plugins. Let's check it out. Let's start off by creating a new comp. Call this VHS. And the first thing I'm going to do is bring in my video footage and I'll leave a link in the description below if you want to use it. First things first, go to Layer, New, Solid, and we're going to type in VHS Effect. And the color is important here. You want to bring your cursor down to black first and then hit the B here and type in 50, 50% 50 black. And go into your Effects panel and type up Add Grain. We're going to click and drag that onto the layer. Hit Preview. Final output, I'm going to select this preset. I'm going to tweak my size to 1.5, my softness to 1.6. And this is creating grain, but uh, VHS grain and TV grain uh, was like a little bit wider than that. So I'm going to increase the aspect ratio to the maximum, 10. And now it's giving us more of like these lines. And when you play it back, it looks like this. After that's done, go back into the effects panel and look up displacement map and drag and drop it onto your video layer. Select VHS effect to select this layer as your displacement map. Oh, and uh, also what you could do is go to your blending modes and select hard light. Now this will pass through and reveal your video layer. If you can't find the blending option here, that means you just need to hit the toggle switch to, to get that going. Click again on your video layer you then have to click on Source here and click on Effects and Masks. If you don't do that, when you click and drag your uh, maximum horizontal displacement and vertical displacements, nothing will happen. So click on Effects and Masks. And then once you start moving these around, they'll, they'll move and get affected by the grain layer. So I'm going to move this a little bit more on the horizontal side and maybe leave this at 5 on the vertical. And you'll see as I increased the sizing on the horizontal, you start getting this kind of stuff on the, um, on the sides here. So one way to fix that, click on your video layer, click on S for scale, and let's just increase that by a bit to remove that. And now if we hit play, you'll see we've got grain and the layer underneath is being affected by it. And to quickly show you how to apply this onto text, it's very easy. You would right-click on your video, pre-compose, and I'm going to opt to leave all attributes in effects, uh, VHS effects. So click OK. Now we've got a pre-comp and our displacement map is still here. So double click on your pre-comp. I'll grab my easy reveal text and drag and drop that in there. This could be any text that you write in here, anything at all. I'm just using the last tutorials example to show you. So now I've got this effect that's in here, and you see the VHS effect is gone. What I can do is go into my easy reveal text and change what's written here. All right, now when we go back into our comp, we'll see that the text has been updated. And if we go back into our VHS effect, you'll see now that the text is also being affected by the same VHS grain layer. And that's how you can easily add text to have the same VHS effect as your overall composition. And there you have it. That's how you create an easy and fast VHS effect inside of After Effects. Hope you liked it. See you next time.